the 1950s, being gay was viewed as a psychological dysfunction. People even received electroshock therapy to be cured today. We know that all forms of sexuality are part of the natural human spectrum. Part of the natural human spectrum? That's right, Jess. It's a continuum. A continuum? That gives me an idea. I need you to help me with a little science project. Okay? What kind of science project? It's a double-blind experiment, so I can't tell you. Double-blind? Okay. This experiment will test whether I can use Pavlovian conditioning to move you down the Kinsey scale. That continuum Professor Green was describing in class. Jess, I don't understand. You're like, totally straight, right? Oh dear lord, of course I am. Well, my experiment is going to see if we can move you a bit down the Kinsey scale. That's homophobic, Jess. You can't make someone gay. I know. But this experiment will test if I can get you to associate the sight of gay sex with sexual arousal. Jess, you know I wouldn't be a part of something like that. I know, right? That's why you're tied to that chair. Jess, stop. You can't do this. That's what I thought. At first, it was really hard to figure out, but genius prevailed. I got a nice selection of man-on-man -man porn for you to watch. Oh my lord. And I blackmailed that bitch, Lizzie, with some disgusting video of her and the Dean. So, she'll be giving you a hand from under the desk while you're watching the video. That's insane. Scientific geniuses are often thought of as crazy, but I must be willing to suffer for the sake of progress, right? I don't understand. The experiment is to see if I can get you to associate the pleasure of that bitch Lizzie's skanky hand with the man-on-man -man action you'll be watching. I'll observe from the other room to give you some privacy. Oh my dear lord. Oh, hi Lizzie. It's just people's bodies, right? Oh sweet Jesus. Oh dear lord. Oh my god. Oh sweet baby Jesus. So in conclusion in class, my experiment was a total success. The test subject is recuperating at a retreat run by his church. And that bitch, Lizzie, figured out that even if someone gives you an incriminating video, they still have unlimited copies to blackmail you again. And that, my dear colleagues, is the beauty of science. Any question? <laughs>